All right, I'm going to do an undergold tutorial, and the first thing you want to do is head down to where you're undergoing. So just come clutch down near the bottom. I'm on Badamja's Hippo Practice Map, so there's going to be these blocks here. If you land on those blocks, you get a successful undergoal. So what you want to do is break some blocks here, and then you need to place this block here. You don't, you can't bridge out anymore. This is the most you can bridge out. And these head hitters built into the map are going to help you, which is why you don't, you're not on the very bottom block, you're one above it. And so you want to break these two block, like these two sets of blocks here, like this, and then shift to the back. And then if you're looking fairly straightforward, you want to do two shift um two shift taps forward, which um are pretty intuitive once you know what they mean. You just hold shift and then tap W twice. And then to make the under goal you want to just do a bunch of head header jumps, but you want to make sure that you press W and space on the same tick for the first one. There's an alternative setup where you mine out more and you can shift to the very back and then you can just run two ticks and then do the head editors which I find less consistent. You wouldn't have to do the W on um, the shift taps which I know some people struggle with, but I think the timing of doing a two tick timing and then spamming, that's, that's just a weirder timing than just jam, which is W in space at the same tick. Um, but for that setup, I've already showed it a couple times, you just break these extra three blocks, which, and then do that. Um. So the reason I really like this under goal is because if there's a hippo above here, like just blocks all the way down here, it's very difficult oops, for them to get down. Like if there's blocks here, there's, you know, probably a full hippo here. They have to really try to get down. And really the most they can block it up is this, where you just break six blocks which really does not take that long even in a competitive game that's not too much of a long time and then you can just go and make it uh, one more important thing to note is that you do not want to rush the W taps if you do them too fast on um, the shift taps uh, it won't work you'll just like um, it can overlap with the movement and you can accidentally hold for like longer than one tick and then over jump. It's not ideal. But yeah, that's how you do the cheesy undergoal.